if they go by just the New Testament, let's see what the New Testament should be been all in to tell them concerning the law. Yeah. It says about Christ and the New Testament. Right, Boom. exactly. Matthew 8, and we're going to start at 1. When he was come down from the mountain, great multitudes followed him. And behold, there came a leopard and worshipped him, saying, Lord, if thou wilt, thou canst make me clean. And Jesus put forth his hand and touched him, saying, I will be thou clean. And immediately his leprosy was clean. Uh. And Jesus said unto him, See thou tell no man, but go thy way. Show thyself to the priest. I mean, go to your preacher and offer the gift that Moses commanded oh. for a testimony unto them. Wait a minute. So what was Christ telling him to do? Read that one more time, bro. What did he say? He told them to show thyself to their preacher and offer the gift that Moses commanded for a testimony unto the them. Gift. What was the gift Moses commanded? The law. Well, <laughs> well, and unless you go into the Old Testament, you'll never know. You'll never, never know if you don't, he, if you don't tell so the you Old can't Testament. Even, you can't even follow what Christ tells you to do if you don't go to the Old. Right, they'll go there to get their tired out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they'll go there to get their Malachi. Uh -huh. How do a man rob God here to play? I thought he was robbing God, God. Well, you can't, oh, you know, first, first, first of all, you perverting the word of God. The tithes was uh, ordered to give to the Levitical priests. They were Levites. You had to prove that you was a Levite to even receive tithes. New bloodline. So which one of you Negroes can prove you're a Levite? I don't want to know. know what they meant they I, Israel, let alone a Levite. You don't even want to prove, you don't even want to say you a Jew. How you a Levite? <laughs> you're a Gentile. Let you tell me. Let you tell that you a Gentile. But even Gentiles know where they from. Yeah, I'm a Gentile, but I'm from Russia. Asians. I'm from Australia. So Gentile nation. But when you say where you from, Gentile, uh, name, right. the, name the Gentile nation. Pull that, pull West Coast Africa. Romans. <laughs> no, let's leave it on. Pull your precepts off. All right. The book of Romans, chapter 8. We start at verse 1. That's good because I was going up next. Go there is therefore now no condemnation to them which are in Christ Jesus. First of all, we got to understand what condemnation means. What does condemnation mean? To condemn. Condemn mean what? I mean, you died. Under the law, you died. They killed you if you broke the law. Go ahead, bro. There is therefore now no condemnation to them which are in Jesus Christ, who walk not after the flesh, but after the spirit. Who walk not after the flesh, but after the spirit. So that means you walk around telling people that you don't cuss, and you don't drink, and you don't do none of that. That's a fleshly thing. Why are you cleaning the outside of the cup if the inside dirt? If you ain't submitted to the will of God, all this face value that you got don't mean nothing. Well, they got to come up with something, you know. I mean, come on, they laid aside the commandments. They laid aside the commandments. They tell you smoking, dancing, and drinking is a sin now. Smoking, dancing, and drinking is a sin now. <laughs> no chapter, no verse. No verse, none of that. Yeah, of course you're supposed to walk circumspect. You're supposed to uh, govern yourself according to the will of God, not according to the will of man, though. Uh -huh. That's the problem. Y'all trying to get the praises of men instead of the praises of the Most High. I got it. Let me pull that real quick. John chapter 5 and what you're talking about. All right. Verse 2. For the law of the spirit of life in Christ Jesus have made me free from the law of sin and death. Sin and what? And death. And death. That means under the law, you got killed. We ain't out here stoning nobody. We ain't putting nobody uh, waist up in the ground. Not yet. And giving them a hell shot. Not yet. Not yet. <laughs> but it will. <laughs> no, ye not the saints gonna judge the world. That's right. But it Christ is coming. Time period. It is coming. Go ahead, bro. For what the law could not do. For what the law could not do. In that it was weak. What was the law weak? What was the law weekend in the flesh? That's Most good. of the ministers can't even tell you what that is. What was the law weak in the flesh? It could never take away sin. It could never take away sin. Hebrews chapter 10, 1 to 4. Go ahead, bro. We're going to pull that. Hebrews chapter 10, we're going to go to that too. Weak through the flesh, God sent in his own son in the likeness of sinful flesh. In the likeness of what? Sinful flesh. So that means your flesh is sinful. 
You can't smell him and eat. I got the Hebrews when y'all read The Hamashiach came from his mother and the Most High. He didn't come from two carnal beings. Come on, bro. And for sin, condemn sin in the flesh. Condemn sin in the flesh. Mm -hmm. That the righteousness of the law. Of the what? Of the law. Say it one more time. That the righteousness of the law might be fulfilled in us who walk not after the flesh, but after the spirit. Babylon will burn. That's right there. Repent. Right there. America will soon be Hold on it. fire. Chapter it's already seven. on fire. Verse 7. I think it's a game. <laughs> huh? What shall we say then? No. Is the law sin? God forbid. Romans chapter 7, verse what? Verse 7. So I know. What shall we say then? Is the law sin? Is the law sin? God forbid. God forbid. So remember, in the Sabbath day, it's not a sin. You ain't going against Christ because you're telling people to remember the Sabbath. The law is not sin. Go ahead, bro. Nay, I had not known sin, but by the law, for I had not known lust, except the law had said, Thou shalt not covet. Now that's a commandment. Paul in New Testament telling you, I had not known sin if it had not been for the law. Uh. Covet, thou shalt not covet is a law. <laughs> Go no, ahead, bro. But you but covet sin, something, you're lusting after it. Taking occasion by the commandment, wrought in me all manner of con concupiscence. 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 That means thoughts. Wickedness. Extreme Wicked thoughts. Wicked thoughts. Extreme. How do you even know what's wrong unless you look at the law? So what's governing your righteousness, Christian? Yes. How do you uh -oh. know what's right? Uh -oh. How you know what's right? Why you know what's wrong? What's governing your righteousness? And let me ask you a question. Have any of the people ever submitted to the will of God? Huh? How we get fast forward into this situation? How we get here? They ain't never, they ain't never loved this gospel. Now everybody's singing Kumbaya. Babylon will burn. Pull it. First Corinthians 15 and 56. Oh. The sting of death is sin. Uh. And the strength of sin is the law. Woo. But thanks to the Most High, which gives us, us a victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. Therefore, my beloved brethren, be ye stand fast oh. and immovable, oh. oh. yeah. always abounding in the work oh. of yeah. the Lord. Yeah. For as much as ye know that ye labor is not in vain yeah. in the Lord. Our labor is not in uh, vain. Babylon will burn. America will burn. Let me finish this off in the grad I need, Ma. All right. I got these Hebrews over when y'all read it. Say verse 8. Right at the you know, watch out, boy. These Bibles are cups. Uh -huh. <laughs> well, without the law. America will burn. Sin know was that. Dead. Without, the, without the law, sin, sin was dead. dead. Come on. For I was alive without the law once. Paul was a Pharisee. What does he mean? He said he was alive without the law once. Without the law of Christ. He was a, he was a Pharisee. He kept the law to the letter, but he didn't do it with Christ. He didn't acknowledge Christ as the Savior. Oh, wretched man that I am. Ahead, but when the commandment came, sin revived, and I died. Mm. Come on, keep going. And the commandment, which was ordained to life, yeah, I found to, to be unto death. Go ahead, bro. For sin, taking occasion by the commandment, deceived me, and by it slew me. Uh. Wherefore the law is holy. The law is what? Is holy. The holy. law is what? Holy. holy. Say it one more time. Holy. The law is holy. What? America was burn. Holy. Jesus was black. And just people. And good. The commandment was holy. The commandment is holy, just, and, and good. Go ahead. Verse 13. Was then that which is good made death unto me. God forbid. Huh. Then that was good. He just said that the law is, and the commandment is holy, just, and good. And that what was holy and just and good was not made death unto him. Mm -hmm. So he telling you it ain't done away with. Yeah. Silly. Right. Boy, Silly. I, I got something. Go ahead, keep reading. Let him finish it off. But sin, that it might appear sin, working death in me by, by that which is good, that sin by the commandment might become exceeding sin. The law is spiritual, but I am born. Uh, the law is spiritual, 
but I am carnal. Come on. Sold under sin. Sold under sin. Come on. For that which I do, I allow not. For that which I do, I allow not. For you Christians who love Paul, he telling you right now. Say it again, bro. Mm. For that which I do, I allow not. He telling you I allow it not. Go ahead. For what I would, for that I do, but wait. I mean, but what I hate that I do. Uh, he tell you what he hate, he still do it. He caught up in between the war between the flesh and the spirit. He man. caught up in the war. Like, look, what I'm supposed to do, I don't do. Right? And what I ain't supposed to be doing, I'm doing. I'm doing it. Oh, wretched man that I am. Oh, wretched, wretched man. Go ahead. America will burn. If then I do that which <laughs> I would not, I consent unto the law that it is good. Uh-huh. It's now then, it. it is no more I that do it. It's no more I that do it, but what? But sin that dwelleth in him. But sin it. that dwelleth in him. We just read in Romans chapter 8, Christ was sent in the, in the image of sinful flesh to condemn sin in the flesh. And Paul going on record telling you right now, he like, look, it ain't me that's doing it. It's the sin that's dwelling in me that's doing it. Yeah, come on, keep going. Verse 18, for I know that in me, that is in my flesh. In my flesh. That in my flesh. <laughs> in my flesh. Wait a minute. Hold on. Oh, Bishop Eddie Long. <laughs> Eddie Thong. TD Snakes. That means that they, they fall under the same banner, don't they? All of us out here do too, right? So while y'all boasting and acting like you're saved already, ain't nobody saved until they heard good and faithful service. Go ahead, bro. It's 1 John chapter 1. I'm going to start at verse 1. That which was from the beginning, which we have heard, which we have seen with our eyes, which we have looked upon, and our hands have held of the word of life. For the life was manifested, and we have seen it, and by witness, and show unto, unto you that eternal life, which was with the Father, and was manifested unto us. That which we have seen and declared we unto you that ye have also may have fellowship with us. And truly our fellowship is with the Father and with his Son Jesus Christ. Let's skip down to that verse 5. Go ahead, bro. This then is the message which we have heard of him. What is it? And declare unto you that God is light. And in him is no darkness at all. Uh -huh. If we say that we have fellowship with him and walk in darkness, we lie and do uh -huh. not the truth. <laughs> and let you know it's a personal conduct. Yeah. Right? It ain't good enough just to know this. Feel me, it's a certain way we're supposed to be carrying ourselves out here. Yeah, I'm gonna finish this out. But if we walk in the light as he is in the light, we have fellowship one with another. And the blood of Jesus Christ, huh. his son, cleanseth us from all sin. From mm. all sin. If we Wait say, if, if we have say. no sin, uh -huh. we deceive ourselves. Oh. One more time. If we say that we have no sin, we deceive you ourselves. You're deceiving yourself. Keep going. The he truth is not in head. us. If we confess our sins, he is faithful <laughs> and just to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. Uh -huh. If we say that we have not, if we have not sinned, oh, man, we wait. make yeah. him a liar. You make him a liar. And his word is not in us. And his word is not in you. Finish that off that Romans 7 because we was going somewhere with Romans that. Romans 7, Finish verse 18. Verse 18, go ahead. For I know that in me that is in, that is in my flesh, Dwelleth no good thing. That sounds like the same thing that the, that the project's read right here. Yeah. I Come got on, one too. I got one too. will uh -huh. is present with me, but how to perform that which is good I find not. You don't even know how to perform which is good Ooh. without God. Without the commandments, you don't even know what's good. Without the law, you don't even know what's good. Come on. For the good that I would, I do not, but the evil which I would not, that I do. Paul on record telling you that the good that I would do, I don't do it. But the evil, I do that. Come on. Now if I do that, I would not. 
it is no more I that do it, but sin that dwelleth in me. I find then a law that when I would do good, evil is present with me. Come on, keep For reading. For I delight in the law of God after the inward man. For I what? For I delight in the law of God after the inward man. I delight after the law of God after the inward man. His spirit, his spirit delights in the law of God after the inward man. Go ahead. But I see another law in my members. I see another law in my members. Come on. Warring against the law of my mind. Come on. And bringing me Ooh. into captivity mm. to the law of sin. What's the law of sin? Mm. Mm. Answer and that. Sin is, a, sin is a law? Come on. Which is in my <laughs> members. Yeah. Oh, wretch man that I am. What are you doing? Who shall deliver me from the body of this death? That's Paul saying wretched man. I thank God through Jesus Christ our Lord. So then with the mind I myself serve the law of God. With uh. the mind I myself serve the law of, of God. God. But, and, go ahead. But with the flesh the law of sin. But with the flesh the law of sin. You got to explain to me what the law of sin is. Uh -huh. What's the law of sin? sin is transgression of the law. Yeah we know that the sin is the transgression of God's law but the law of sin. The morality compass that Moses gave you, that they call the law of Moses, if you can call it Moses' law. Paul telling you right now, inside of me, I serve the law of God. 